All right, guys. Well, TikTok made me do it. <laughs> that should just be the title of this video, yeah. literally. So before we get into it, if you guys don't know, we have a TikTok called The Bogettis where Bronte The Bogetti posts, Bunch. Yeah, The Bogetti Bunch. Mm -hmm. uh, just type in Bogetti, and I'm sure it's the only one that pops up. Right. Because we're the coolest. Yeah. But... Yeah, let me pull this up. We posted a video the other day at Costco, mm -hmm. and they have this scooter for sale. And it is not just any electric scooter. You guys already know, I'm a huge EV fan, huge scooter guy, huge electric scooter guy. So when I show up to Costco and they have a Bugatti flavored scooter, <laughs> you know I gotta go for it. <laughs> well, and we've been in the market for getting a new scooter because yeah. our one is like, going it's downhill now. yeah yep. like we I need a new one. one yeah and it lasted us like a year yeah probably so like it, it still does work yeah it does work it just it dies really fast so we just mm -hmm. we need a new one We'd like two mm -hmm. and so cooper found this one we went to costco and look at it and then i made a tiktok posting about it and i was like we were like should we buy this and we were looking at it and then cooper threw out a number we were talking about and he was like say if it gets twenty thousand likes We'll buy it. Which I, would be insane for like a YouTube video to get 20,000 likes. Yeah, like but that's a lot of likes. TikTok is just like crazy. So yeah, the TikTok army came in full steam ahead. Threw out that number and it's been, when did I post that? Two days. Two days ago. Right. And I just went back to check it and it's at 20,000. I don't know if the area will be able to see that. 20,000.3 likes and it just keeps going up. So Cooper said he was a man of his word and we're going yep. to get it. I mean, the only thing we have in this world is our word. Yeah. So I'm going to, um, I'm gonna go stand by my decision and buy an the electric Bugatti scooter. scooter. <laughs> this thing is pretty nice. I'll show you guys once we get it. It's yeah. pretty tight. We're on our way to Costco now, so. Yeah, and maybe I'll get a couple nice t-shirts. That's what we were gonna do today, is go shopping for just nice t-shirts. <laughs> Little do you know. Friggin' scooter. All right, my arm's hurting. What is going on guys? Today's video is sponsored by Omaze. If you don't know what Omaze is, it is a professional fundraising platform that does sweepstakes. They've given to a lot of really awesome organizations throughout the years. And the one for this sweepstakes in particular is a really cool one. It is the Peterson Automotive Museum. If you guys don't know what they are, they have some really cool cars, a really cool museum. I'd love to make it there one day, but I've seen just so much of it and it is on my bucket list. But aside from that, the car that they are giving away is one of the most iconic cars in American history. And what I find cool about it is it is a kit car. So you can drive it every single day without worrying about driving some insane museum piece. It's museum quality, but you can drive it all the time, enjoy it. Not only does this thing just fit all the good looks, all the raw feeling of a Cobra, but it has the modern power plant of a new 7.3 liter Godzilla V8 from Ford with a five speed manual transmission, 650 horsepower, 17 gallon fuel cell. So you could drive this thing all over the place. Plus the modern engine just makes it that much better. You're not worried about it just breaking down, take it to cars and coffee, go to car shows. How cool is this? A freaking Cobra. Guys, Check out my link. You guys definitely want this car. I mean, we all do. It's just it's just that childhood dream car. Go click the link in my bio to get entered for a chance to win. Huge thank you to Omaze for sponsoring this video. And it is so awesome to see how much money they're giving to charity. Awesome company. Go check them out. Go support them. Let's get to the video. Big purchase today. We got it. Costco always gets me. I know, always. Always get me spending money. We got a Bugatti scooter. How do you feel? Pretty pumped. Does your wallet hurt? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Definitely felt that. Yep. <laughs> None of the cars got any faster either. <laughs> no. We got a cool scooter to ride around the track in now. <laughs> Something happened. <laughs> it's home. Look at it. Pretty cool. Yep, here's the uh, receipt for the price. Here's the receipt, uh, $962. That's what it came out to. With tax. Dang. <laughs> How's your wallet feeling? It's gone. It stayed at Costco. <laughs> they own it now. Yeah. No more using. I don't even own my wallet anymore. Yeah, they your cut wallet. the card after that. 
All right, we gonna unbox this thing? Yes. <laughs> Is that a bad sign? <laughs> Don't judge thou on their packaging. Judge them on their product. I'm treating it like it owes me money. Oh, I see now. Is it this side? No, it just like the whole, oh. it's like a sleeve. Here we go. Oh! oh. oh. Whoa! Oh! <laughs> Look at that! Oh my god! I don't want to cut that sticker. Oh my god. That's pretty cool. Wait. Sounds great. <laughs> Not to brag, but... <laughs> That's great. That belongs there. Wow. <laughs> My god. Keeps getting cooler and cooler. Safety reflector, brake lights, ergonomic deck. Dang. Oh, this is, this is pretty nice. Yeah. I'll be honest. There she is. Some nice showmanship to their packaging here. Wow. This is just like their little introduction to it. A work of art created and engineered to deliver a new wave of mobility in a transit revolution. Wow. Oh <laughs> okay. <laughs> Goodness. I didn't think I was ready for a revolution. <laughs> I just bought a scooter. Wait, what's that? This is like the tool. What's that? Is this card? I don't know. It's the authentication. It's not too heavy. I couldn't really pick it up in the store. Easy peasy, it looks like. Looks easy enough. Opening this up is an experience. Yeah, it is. It was cool. It's like buying like an Apple product. Yeah. Packaging is part of the experience. I like. I want to compare it to the other one, but it feels wrong. Because <laughs> yeah. it's like that one is the cheapest one for a reason. Yeah. This part is also seems like it's kind of tall, like for me at least. It does seem pretty tall. Yeah. Having trouble here on these screws. We got power. <gasps> Looks like it's full. I'll peel off the thing. Right. Peeling her off. Ooh. <laughs> So I'm setting one right now. Well, look at the, f the like fuel it's saying. I'm yeah. Full. <laughs> it's got blinkers. Wow. Got blinkers. Wow. Wait, let's get away from this bike. It looks silly next to this bike. That's a snazzy unit right there. Dang. Well, I guess I'll take the maiden voyage. Go for it. Wait, let me follow you. <laughs> <laughs> there he goes. What? Wow. Is it? Dang. I want to ride it. Give us your first thoughts. I like it. I like the sounds it makes. I like the I like the feel of it. Is it fast? Yeah, it's pretty fast. Woo! And it's Bugatti, so it's a lot cooler. Yeah. And it, look at like these lights that it has on it. Watch like the side. It's got side lights. It's got a rear light. Sounds really cool. I love it. Woo! Braking, it's like. Woo! Yeah. And then when you're going faster. It's pretty nice. It rides nice though. I mean, it does actually rip a little bit. You don't really need much more than that. Let me take the GoPro and I'll ride with it. Yeah, I got up to 17. It actually is fast. Yeah, so honestly. And it feels really smooth. Yeah, too. so I realize I'm more concerned about it having good, like, range yeah, than I am it having speed. speed. Yeah. Because, like, the speed, like, it doesn't really matter that much when you're on a racetrack. Yeah. Which is no, weird to sure. say. Yeah. But, no, but the range thing. The is range is important. Okay. It sounds really cool when you're like going and breaking. Okay. See, it's got this like futuristic sound to it. 
15. Okay, so here's our OG one that we've had for a while. It's definitely smaller, uh, it's shorter, it's lighter too, but it has less battery power and it has just less going on. Like this all doesn't do anything. All the batteries are in here and then the motor's there. This one, the batteries are there and the motor is in the back. This one's been good to us for 250 bucks. It has been pretty good, but this one I'm way more pumped about bringing to the track and really excited to use it. Look at that paint job too. Should be pretty nice. All right, so I've had this for a little while now and I wanted to show you guys some of the cool features I've found on it. So it has blinkers on the sides here. See those blinkers on each side? Freaking sick. It's got a bell. It has, if you double tap that button, it has this that shines the Bugatti logo on the ground. Look at that. When you hit the brakes, it gets brighter. Brake lights. It's got front headlight. I don't know what this lower guy is. Oh, just a reflector. So it's got the reflector there, front headlight. Tells you when the headlight's on. Three speed modes. It's pretty nice. Yeah, that's what oh, I'm talking about. Oh, that's nice. It like clicks Ooh. in right here. And you can just lift it like that? Mm -hmm. Is it heavy? Not bad. Wait, I want to just lift it just to feel. No, oh, not bad. No. Like if I was like, I don't know, like if I was like in a city or something, like I could like carry this into my apartment. Yeah, for sure. That's really nice. Yeah, it folds up really well. Yeah. I could never like carry the old scooter. Because no, it was so awkward. Yeah. That, yeah, I like the click, like the clip back there. All right, pretty pumped. Got the Bugatti, so that's gonna do it, guys. Um, I really like electric scooters. If you guys know of any more that are pretty great, comment them down below because I am curious and maybe, maybe we'll just get a fleet of electric scooters because I'm in for that. I'll do that right now, but. <laughs> If you guys are interested in buying one, I wouldn't hesitate, but that'll do it. Thanks for watching. Keep it saucy. I'll see you next time.